In this video, I'm going to show you how to solve internal server error in Gcash. So first, open up your Gcash and make sure that it is updated. So once you open Gcash, you will see that it will pop up this message time for an update. So make sure that you update it before opening the app. So go to Play Store and find Gcash and here just tap on update. Once it's updated, go to settings, scroll down and find apps. Next in the search bar, type in Gcash. Tap on it. Next tap storage. Next tap on clear data. Next click on delete. Once done, just go back and exit out settings and then click on Gcash. So you just have to accept all these permissions requested by the app. And here just type in your Gcash number or the number that you have registered and continue with the verification. So make sure that you put in the verification code sent to your phone. And that's it. 